Cohen Dragna War, Mickey Cohen, born Cohen Meyer Harris, September 4, 1913, in Brooklyn, New York. Died on July 29, 1976. Mickey Cohen was an affable if slightly mentally unbalanced drug pusher in L.A., by way of Chicago. Jack Dragna represented the Los Angeles Mafia, the so-called Mickey Mouse Mob. Originally from Brooklyn, the Coens moved to Los Angeles in 1920, where Mickey's father ran a drug store. At the start of Prohibition, the Coens made gin in the back of the store. Mickey, at age nine, was the operation's delivery boy until he was arrested. Cohen turned to prize fighting in his teen years and had a brief but respectable career before he landed in Chicago and worked in the Capone organization at various odd jobs but was forced to leave town after he took part in a gun battle that left several gamblers dead. Cleveland mobster Lou Rothkopf is said to have taken a liking to Cohen, something that was easy to do, and sent him to Los Angeles to work with Bugsy Siegel. When Siegel was murdered in 1947, Cohen was granted most of the dead gangsters' gambling operations around Los Angeles. It was around this time that Cohen supposedly introduced a hoodlum named Johnny Stompanato to troubled movie starlet Lana Turner. Cohen then wired Stompanato's bedroom and recorded the actress and Stompanato having sex and then pressed 2,000 copies of the master recording and sold them for $5 each. Turner's daughter, Cheryl, later stabbed Stompanato to death in a killing ruled to be justifiable homicide. The essence of the Dragna Cohen war was control and power. Although Dragna was the unquestioned mafia power west of Las Vegas, he felt slighted within the ranks of the traditional mob that moved in on Las Vegas without so much as a nod to him and felt generally disrespected by freelance hoods like Mickey Cohen and Jack Whalen who ran their bookie and narcotics operations without a cut to Dragna. Dragna and Cohen could not be more different. Jack Dragna. He was born Ignazio Dragna but renamed himself 